welcome back to my channel my name is mrs ashley and today i am doing an unboxing from stitch fix it is finally here i know last year i said when i was doing the unboxings for d and co that i would do stitch fix and guess what i actually have stitch fix it's just like any other box um that deals with um styling fee you get the 20 dollars styling fee and that styling fee will be um, towards any purchase that you make within the items, the items that you do or do not like. Um, if you do not like them, you could put it, they uh, provide a bag for you to put in and you just send it back to the post office and those items will be returned. You will not be charged for any of the items that you don't keep. You only get charged for the ones that you do. I actually have a link down below if you guys want to check out Stitch Fix. They do have a men's section as well as a children's section. If you need those in your life, they have that as well, as well as maternity clothes as well. So, um, yeah, I'll have everything linked down below, down below. Okay, so since this is going to be a recurring box every two months, I will be having a video every two months. So you can expect this video to go up. Um every two months and yeah so let's get this unboxing going so in my quiz I did state that I wanted size 18 as you guys noticed from um notice from my Ross uh inside the dressing room and that Inside the dressing room at Ross, I was a size 18, and that's the one that I picked out. So in my styling um, quiz, I picked that, as well as I did let my stylist know that I am on the short side, um, and that, I'm, uh, that I would opt to get a petite size if, if need be. Um, but yeah, so, oh, that's pretty cool. So, Stitch Fix, they have um, little sayings on the box here. So, thanks for letting us style you was on this side and then on this side. Okay, so what to do next? It says, discover and decide. Um, try on all five items that your personal stylist selected for you. Pair them with favorites from your closet and use the enclosed style cards for outfits inspirations etc share your thoughts send it back and also when they do look up your style they do um ask you to connect your instagram and um if you have a pinterest maybe you want to try out some different styles from your pinterest so you can upload your pinterest board as well on there okay so like i said it comes with the send back bag as well as a your stylist thought these would look great on you card which is really cool this is what the inside of the box looks like um it, and it also for the um items that you do have uh they have like little outfits ideas that you could pair because I'm not the best at putting together outfits and stuff like that. So this is really handy for me to say, hey, that looks good with this. This goes with that kind of thing. I usually, back in the day when I was in high school, my mom used to do all the um, clothes picking. And unfortunately for me, she would always say, that wouldn't look good on you unless you lost this much weight. But as you guys know... Now we are at a day and age where we can pick clothes that we love and yet I still need help with picking out clothes that look good on me and my body. So this is a great handy tool to have, but don't let anybody stop you from wearing what you want to wear. Let's get into the items. Well, from what I see, it doesn't look like I got any accessories or anything like that. Um, this one is by August Mist. It's a 1X and it's, um, this material, material here, it's actually really flowy. Great for spring. Love the pattern. 
love this pattern detail how it like shows off this part and it also shows off the back I do have a tattoo here I don't think it would see through from here and it's spring and it gets hot I live in uh, northern Cali so I think we get like a little bit more rain and then it's off to being summertime so that's really good to know good to have is a really nice white blouse now this next one is actually really really cute all these things are so cute um it's gonna be really hard for me to pick um which is really good because D and Co didn't really hit my mark last year so um this one is from Mason Bell 1X and it is a Laria crochet trim kimono. I've always wanted the kimono and it's this color right here and it has the lace detail right there. Oh my God, this print is everything. I'm in love. You could style kimonos with bathing suits or anything like that if you um if you wanted to go to like a picnic or something and you have like shorts or a dress on it this would like up the ante so this oh my god i'm gonna have to look at the prices for these because y'all know if it's cute it's usually going to be a higher priced um the quality of the clothes definitely is up there um i feel the quality on so far the the two clothing uh the two clothes the two items is like a really great quality um i can't be mad at it so i'm not going to be surprised if it's expensive okay so this next one is a maroon color from hawthorns it's a 1x in Burgundy, this is a neem split neck knit top. So the split is in the middle here, which I've seen this at Ross. Um, I've seen a black one at Ross before. Um, definitely, we'll definitely try it to see how it fits on me. I've never tried it on at Ross before, but I have seen these at Ross for a lot. Um, depending on the, what the price is um, for for this item, um, I'm pretty sure I could probably pick this up a little bit cheaper at Ross, but the quality is really great. It's really heavy, really sturdy. Um, it's kind of that stretchy material, so we'll see how that pairs. I'm not too excited because it's just a one color, um, one color tank top, which I do have a burgundy tank top, but not not like that, but um, I do have one similar. So the item is, you guys know, I like the sweater thing. I mean, I'm wearing my uh, mauve one here. Oh my God. Okay. So I love this sweater material. It's a cardigan. I love lay layering things and I don't have enough pieces to layer stuff with. Um, this is Love Ellie. And what I like about this cardigan already that I see is the fact that it has a hood. And I can't say no to a good hood. Like this, who, who styled me? Because this is like not even fair ruby ruby is her name and if you are watching this right now ruby you did a great great job and the only thing that i could probably say is if the items are super super expensive and i can't keep them all just know you did a great job with picking out these items because Oh my god this is so breathable fabric it's super nice it, it keeps you cool it's like that spring to winter vibe and 
you know, it's coming up right now. You know, we just had daylight savings and everything like that. So it might get hotter sooner than later. This next item is a pant and it's in the color, like a navy color. Oh yeah, it's a denim. It's dark, dark uh, denim. Harrison skinny jean in indigo. As you guys know, I kept my um, my Jessica Simpson uh, skinnies from DN Co. That one time, I did definitely bite the bullet on that. Um, don't know how much the pricing goes for Stitch Fix, but this is the 1822 denim, and it's in the um, it's in 18 women's ankle skinny. And that will definitely most likely fit because it has stretch here. So let me try these on and let's see if I like any of these and the pricing. Okay. Okay. okay so I know you can't see my face, but you can see the clothing. Um, as you can see, this is very clean to the body, but it does give me some shape here i do need a new bra people leave your suggestions down below please help a girl out because i am in between sizes of like my cup size is a b and but the width is a 40 um and i know you can only get the 40 sizes in size the cup c's but anyway about the shirt love it it actually gives some definition to my body shape so that's a really good plus for me um i thought it would be it is a little heavy but it's nothing that i can't work with and then here are the indigo uh jeans style jeans here so the they have a back pocket here and it's actually functioning but there's it's a fake pocket up in here. So that's the only thing that's sad about some of the jeans that I find in 18 or 16 petites is that their skinnies usually have fake pockets. Um, and I wish that we had, you know, working functioning pockets. But I mean, it does have functioning pockets in the back. It does give me a very nice um, high-waisted look here. So since it's a dark wash here that you can't really see my pooch as much here, definitely want to diminish that a little bit of the year 2019 as it goes on. Just saying. Um, but with this, it's kind of like kind of like camouflage, especially if you if you tend to wear your blouses like this. You totally cover it. You're not having like peekaboo camel toe anywhere um and anything like that and it looks super cute definitely want to pair this with the kimono because it does have the kimono has um that coloring the kimono is a plus because i can pair this with anything i want that i have already in my closet um and this shirt is great and cute do i have a color like this in my wardrobe already yes um did i just buy ross pants that kind of simulate this but it's black instead of the indigo yes so i mean i'm looking at the only thing that i possibly would like to keep is probably the kimono because that's the only thing that is different in my wardrobe and that's something that I would like other than that the other two pieces are great fit they look great on me but I already have some more pieces that I already bought um so I'm gonna have to pass on the this shirt and this pants and know that the pants in any any 18 in your size i'm four foot 11 so if they're high-waisted and their ankle they're great fit um they fit the butt and they fit the waist high-waisted um and then on the ankles i know you can't see them but they actually 
fit in the ankle region so yeah I can't show that off but um, they do fit on the ankle region and then they, they're not too long so that's great there's no hemming involved if you do decide to get a pair of um, do decide to get these pair of pants and you're the same height as me so yeah the only thing that I could say about the outfit is this is definitely up my alley and I would love to keep everything here but I think the only winner is probably the kimono oh, no she didn't okay so I still kept on the pants because I just wanted to try something on with the pants wise this is another shirt and so this shirt obviously it's see-through you can see my bra through it but normally I would probably pair this with um a tank top underneath or like a bodysuit underneath like a body um, tank top or something like that or a tube top that you know tucks into the pants here because this definitely has a flowy flowy vibe I mean you could do a whole bralette let it show let your a game go detail right here is super pretty um, the hubby complimented this blouse, so I feel like he, he wants me to keep this one. <laughs> um, I'm going to show you the back here. And the back as well has that detail and has like this button. But, I mean, I didn't need to unbutton this to put this on. This is very, very um, flowy and I didn't need to unbutton anything. Because usually sometimes you get shirts that look like this like I I know I probably tried on like a, a I think it was a forever 21 or something like that and it has the button up here in the back and this material wasn't stretchy enough for me and this is also a 1x and I've gotten their 2x's and girl it was not for me because it would be choking me out and I would unbutton and the button is whack it it was it was a bad idea but they got this fit just right I could pair this and go to a picnic I could you know it's very flowy in the sleeves it's got flowy I mean I'm ready for spring at this point this could be like a topper uh with shorts or a skirt or you could you could even um underneath have like your bathing suit and it could be a bathing suit topper like I I really 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 like this okay so this is the cardigan and I definitely don't need a cardigan like this not that I don't like it I love it this is my style I do have a sweater that looks exactly like this and um, but it's not a cardigan and it doesn't have a hood I mean the hood you have to have the hood like you know what I mean like that is that is a look right there guys it's got a slit right here and you be like anyway this is a nice flowy in between summer you know it's not it doesn't it has a breathe it's breathable so you could air your pits out if you want <laughs> Um, it's warm enough to keep you nice and warm when it's the in-between weather. Um, I super like this because, I mean, it's working for me. It's definitely working for me. Love the hood. It's a good, I mean, I have no complaints about this box and it sucks because I'm pretty sure it's going to cost a lot. It's going to cost a lot. It's going to cost a lot. Everything is super cute. I can't complain about these boxes. I am getting these boxes every two months. So hopefully that I can save up on my next box when the next box comes. I can and they still, you know, do me right. I'm gonna keep everything in that box. If you like this um, video, please give me a thumbs up if you did. Uh I'll be coming at you with another unboxing in the next two months, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Like always, stay super sweet. Bye.